The Boise State football team is taking on Hawaii tomorrow night on the blue. Kickoff is at 815 and this week is a big matchup on the field because both teams have a combined nine and one record. But off the field, it also has some meaning. For more on this now, we bring in our Jay Test. And Jay, it sounds like tomorrow's mm -hmm. game is pretty meaningful for some of these players because of a wedding last summer. Yeah, Tammy, these guys have a very unique uh, connection. This week's matchup is a meaningful one for both Keikoa Nawahine and Keikala Kaniho. Both have deep ties to Hawaii, and Keikala, well, he even calls the island home. Over the last three years, though, these two have formed a brotherly-like bond. It wasn't until Keikoa's wedding over the summer that Keikala found out that being a football brother isn't exactly like being a blood brother. Take a look. The dance. When my older brother got married, they did a dance. And so I was like, hey, we're going to do a brother's dance too. <laughs> procrastinated, procrastinated. It's like the week of the wedding. I'm like, hey, we need to like, be serious about this because this isn't like a little thing. Like, it's not easy to just throw together. I mean, that's kind of Kikola style is just kind of kind of roll with it and not really have too much things planned. We just practiced for like hours a few days before the wedding nonstop. I'm downstairs like sweating like crazy. We're scrolling through Instagram one day and I see his older brother Khalil post a video of them doing doing the practice moves of it. And I comment back thinking like, we, got, we all got to learn it. It was always just like a brother's dance and I didn't expect him to learn anything, but he saw a video come out on Instagram. So I'm thinking I got to watch Instagram to learn the dance because they're not going to tell us nothing. So I'm over there practicing the dance based off of Instagram. <laughs> I, come, I came to football the next day and he like already knew all the moves. It was cracking me up. And then uh, they tell me, oh, it's just for the brothers. And I started like laughing and telling them like, hey, if you guys need a backup, just know I've been practicing through the Instagram videos and stuff like that. <laughs> uh, well, if you watch the videos, like you can see him on the side, like doing it, like slightly doing the moves with us, which always cracks me up. Whenever I rewatch him, I love watching him on the side. It's funny, you know, even that day of the wedding, I was like, if you guys need a backup dancer, you know where I'm gonna be, right next to the stage. So I was just on the side of there having a, having a good time watching them do their thing. <laughs> It was really fun and uh, just watching like his wife, her reaction was really good to see all of them just having fun together. Pro probably the best highlight of both those guys will show you all season <laughs> long. Maybe the most memorable one for sure. Um, that whole dance though, Timmy, it's over like four minutes long. Wow. The brothers did a great job of like uh, getting all together and choreographing it and it was, it was pretty awesome. It was impressive. Yeah. And yeah. how cool is it that K. Cal is so committed that he was going to learn the dance I love regardless. that. You I, could see him on the right, right? side doing I, his I, moves. I gotta ask, <laughs> Tammy, your husband name coincidentally is also Jay. Would Jay ever do anything like that? Uh, yes, he would. He would? He would love it. Okay, well then would we, you? Share, we share the same first name, but uh, we don't share <laughs> the same dance That's moves. That's about it. Uh, uh, apparently, yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. What's up, Jay, by the way? <laughs> Well, I always love to say that when we used to do the weekends at mm. night together, I used to text Jay, this Jay, yeah. thinking it was my husband Jay, and we have some fun. I forgot to do the those. dishes apparently a couple of times. <laughs> or walk it's the okay. dog. Or walk the dog. Yeah. <laughs> well, don't forget the Broncos are ranked 14th in the country, entering tomorrow night's game. Mm -hmm. Again, the game starts at 8:15 on the Blue tomorrow. Yeah, we're gonna have the Bronco Roundup pregame show coming your way from 5 to 5:30 right here on Idaho's News Channel 7. Then we're also gonna have an additional pregame show that runs from 7 to 8 o'clock on KTV.com as well as on Idaho's very own 24/7. And be sure to download our game day guide. All you have to do, by the way, is text BSU. 208-312-5614. Text messages and data rates reply. Uh, it will guide you basically everything you know to tomorrow night's game against Hawaii. Check it out.